What's going on guys, it's Pac-Man Jones with Savannah Seaport News and today I'm going to bring you another Savannah artist. Her name is Quana MC. Uh, she comes from Savannah, Georgia uh, by way of the east side. And it's actually pretty cool because she's the first person, uh, well Savannah artist to uh, reach me back when I reached out to her because I wanted to get more information about her and uh, where she's from and you know just small artist information and she was the first person to reach out to me so that's uh that's pretty cool that's mad respect she graduated from uh jenkins high school which is the same high school i went to when i graduated in 2010 so that's pretty dope too and uh when she graduated from jenkins she moved to atlanta where she attended clark atlanta university where she graduated with a bachelor's in english and after when she graduated from uh, Clark Atlanta University in Atlanta, uh, she moved to uh, New York to further her career. And you can tell that she moved to New York because in her EP, uh, Queenie EP, that she dropped, and I'm going to uh, give you guys the link to all of her uh, music, her Facebook pages, and uh, whatnot. So I'm going to give you guys all the links to it because I want you guys to really listen to her music and because I listened to her whole EP twice and I had to listen to her EP twice because I really wanted to understand her content her flow and her rhythm as a uh, as an artist and she named her uh, album Queenie after Stephanie St. Clair she was uh, born in 1886 I believe and um, she was born on a French East Caribbean island off of uh, Guadalupe and traveled to the United States when uh, she got to the United States when she was about 13 years old. And later, uh, she established herself in Harlem uh, with the uh, numbers banks. And uh, between like the late 1920s and the early 1930s with the uh, Great Depression and the uh, Prohibition era, uh, the, the Mafia was seeing how much money she was making and they wanted, to, the Mafia was trying to impose on her and she did a good job uh, fighting the uh, mobsters off and that's what she named her uh, album after. And it definitely relates to her because her intro for uh, the Queenie album, uh, the intro is basically of her having dialogue between this other person and the person just asking her where she's from and she says uh, she's from the country from Savannah and she's uh, moving up north uh, my guess is like around the Brooklyn area uh, whereas uh, where she relocated to um, and you can tell in her raps that uh, the uh, New York influence that she has and that's pretty cool you know and that's what some of the album is about is from her moving from the south up north and getting used to the New York lifestyle and talking about the things that's really going on in her life as far as like her love life and uh, you know sex <laughs> of course and uh, you know just guys that's uh, 
running games and and she has some turn up songs too. Uh, I'm gonna play one at the end by her uh, featuring Tico Texas called uh, Boston. Uh, that's one of my favorites. I I really like that joint. Also, she has the uh, hashtag Carefree Black Girl, um, and I was uh, looking into it. Uh, if you guys want to look into her hashtag, uh, I'll throw the hashtag in the um, I'll, I'll throw the hashtag in the description as well. I I'll, I want you guys to check it out and see how you guys like it. And and the only advice I can give her is uh, just produce more content. Uh, I'm a big fan of artwork and a lot of content. If you can give me a lot of content, uh, maybe if you can do another album or mixtape, uh, do more videos because I'm a I'm a fan of the internet. Uh, I don't watch TV at all, so everything that I do is basically on the internet, YouTube, uh, streaming, music videos. So I just want her to put out more content so where that she can just be viewed by everyone, everyone everywhere. And she's already doing the right thing uh, as far as moving to New York because I bet she has more exposure than she can get in Georgia or in Savannah any given day. So she's doing the right thing. I just hope that she gets all the exposure she needs and um, get that record deal if she's uh, hopefully looking for one. But that's all I got right now. But definitely check her music out. Uh, Look at her YouTube videos and her SoundCloud and even check out her uh, her Twitter and her Facebook. But that's all I got right now. It's your boy, Pac-Man Jones with Savannah Seaport News, and I'm out. Shot it. Right. 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 Right.